Hello guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to take a look at the Super Shoot Polaroid LAN camera. Got the battery that's holding it up. Um, this camera was made in the year 1975. Um, that's the production year. It's a well-made camera. Uh, it's an instant camera. So basically you take the picture, yeah? And then the camera uh, instantly print out your picture, photo. Uh, I'll be sure I'll be going over how to do that. I don't have a film for it I'll, I'll just show you as if you do have a film this camera itself is pretty dusty. I haven't cleaned it uh, Let me just go over some features this camera have first back here Metal Instruction gu guide to show you how to use it uh, how to take pictures in the right distance uh, all that Film type, flash, the distance that you should go, it will, depends on the flasher that you have, uh, or they call it the light cube, I think, is it light cube, I think, uh, I can't remember, oh, there's Angel, cameo, there she is, um, and she'll be making noises in the back, so that's how you basically tell you how to operate um, this thing right here, this goes in the back here, just slides right in, uh, this will benefit this piece right here will benefit you over in your overall profit There's a band here. I do not have it that decrease the profit because not a hundred percent complete But you know having this will be nice and there's a little writing in here cursive very cool um, Camera you basically take a look at here. You can see Angela There you go. Can you see her? She's eating herself Um. You can, the way you take a picture is you go here right now, it's unlocked. Uh, you take a picture by pressing this button down. It makes a sound as if grandma broke her hip. And you lock it by pressing this, just turning it so you won't, you know, mess up in case you kept it in a bag or accidentally waste your film. And right here, it tells you the distance. So, focus, please. So, let me get my light over here so y'all can see. Right now, it's on 3000. Uh, is using this top right here. You're turning it, and it zooms in, zooms out, like that. So, that's top. That's on the white part. And red part, you just flip it. You have to really flip it. Now, that's red. 78, 75. My bad. Around, you can see here on the lens, there's different numbers for it. And that's on red right now. Yeah, very nice. Here's where the flash cube will go. Plugs right, uh, put it in here, twist it. Um, there's a shielding for it, it's not that good. It had yellowed with age. Um, you can fix that with um, proper chemicals, but I do not have. And the metal is here, metal hinge. And uh, here's the brightness of it, dark and light. Uh, that's, that's just how the knobs will turn, you just have to what see what your circumstances is and see what you have to do to uh, operate different features with the camera to get yourself a clearer picture um the after you do take after you finish taking the picture you done breaking your grandma's hip the picture will come out of here buzz right out of here and to insert the film and the batteries it takes two double a batteries you have to Go to this latch right here, metal latch. Flip this open. Open this. Uh, it would be nice if my 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 phone is not nearsighted. Uh, right here. So there's some warnings. Keep the rollers clean. To remove lift here. Let's try that. I've never done this, so I don't want to break anything. Let's see what this do. I'm curious. I've never done this before. To remove lip here, what do you mean? Here? Here is, oh, what am I trying to do? Lift here. I wonder what they're talking about. I'm sure it's obvious, but I have never done this before. I bought this and I appreciated it. Look at it on my wall and that's it. So let's not try to break it. Um, but I, I am curious, how do I remove it? Oh, there's two different, to remove lip here interesting K 
can't, that's the metal. You cannot lift that part. But somehow the red part do goes up. Oh, wait. Yeah, I think it goes up. I think I figured it out. Do I, do I do this? Yep, I got it. Oh, I broke it. <laughs> that's the roller. Keep it clean. Roller. Uh, you want to keep this lubricated so your film will roll right, right out. It won't jam everything. Just keep it clean. Uh, try not to break it. Like what I'm fixing to do. Uh, you just push this in. Push the roller in first. Let me get this fixed up. Push the roller in. It's sticky. So I might, you know, I might even take it out to even just clean it. But I don't think so. I'm just going to keep it in there. And then push this down. Lock that up. Perfect. Your film will go in here. Um, your film will go in here. I'm going to show you where the battery goes. Change. Look at this. You might have a change battery at least yearly. Now, I'm going to show you how to get the batteries in there. As you can see, if my light is not freaking out, uh, open here. Little tab. Pick it open. Pull this, and it tells you the double A, one point five volt double A battery. One goes in here, heads first. Positive, negative. Push it in, lock it, back up. Done. Don't have the film, so just appreciate what I do have. Um, wait a second. Yeah, that is right, because there's also plus signs, plus signs over here. Very nicely detailed. Uh, now, after all that, that's done. Camera itself is shown. Everything else is done. And you, know, you can hug this camera while I tell everyone the price. Now, while the camera is resting comfortably on her leg, I'll be going over the prices. Uh, resale value, that will be going 20 to $25. I do see these cameras going up to $40 on eBay, and um, I think mine is worth $40, yeah, I think so. Um, I I think it's a nice, neat little camera. Look at the des design of it. How do you say you hate this? Angel will be my photography. She'll be taking this camera to take pictures. Um, yeah, the one I have in the condition is in, that'll be, yeah, around 20 bucks. That's pretty about right it doesn't work that much it's not a rare camera it's um, massively produced and it's not it's not rare at all if you tell about rare cameras there are a bunch but this is this is popular so as well produced and um i just think it's a nice little neat piece that i would like to show you guys and this is uh, one of my from my collection i do love cameras especially polaroids and kodak they're my two favorite brands. They're well-known brands and they're big brands. And I really enjoy this. Um, cameras nowadays, they have Fuji that can recreate what it's like to taking it, uh, an instant photo. Or if you can, you know, you can buy an old one and try to do it. But usually those films are not good. Um, I don't know if they recreate those films or not. I don't know. But they do have it in... Um, modernized versions of those camera like Fuji um, I do enjoy doing this I hope you guys enjoyed this video uh, this is a beautiful camera I really enjoyed it and I hope you guys learned something in this video uh, so I can mark my video as educational so it will look better on YouTube alright hope you guys enjoyed and have a good day